So this is squaring up a turret on a on that same Genos L300M. You got to pull that turret cover off. You also got to push push those weight covers up to get to the access to the bolts. This turret, I use uh, BDI test bars, so that turret was 28 thou or 26 thou out and six inches. So. To loosen the turret up to square it up, it's setting on the x-axis. You got a 14 millimeter. You need a 14 millimeter wrench from the bottom side. The rest of them, there's five more. 10 millimeter wrench to get that. You got two down here, one in the center. And you got one up underneath there and then one on the other corner. So I leave one of them snug. I push the turret all the way up. And then uh, I leave this screw right here on this left corner. I, I, I leave that just snug. And then I just tap when I want to move the turret on my test bar. I just tap that a little bit and I keep, uh, I get it square with my uh, C axis travel to my test bar. And the reason I pull these big weight covers back, this weight cover has five bolts on the bottom. They go right there. One, two, Four, five, and then there's a bracket that bolts up there. Now, if you don't, these gibs are covered. The Z-axis gibs have wipers over them. It's impossible, and there's a screw hidden underneath. Then the, the actual screw that adjusts that keeper is underneath that way, so it's impossible to do without pulling that back. That's a pain to pull that guard back and put it back on. Putting it back on is even worse, but all the, all the gibs are covered with wipers so yeah that's the reason I pulled that big thing back so I'm gonna square this turret up and I uh, probably won't get the wipers back on today but oh well but that's where your bolts are square up one of these genos not a fun job though thanks